Welcome to Share Talk, the only podcast where investors come first. Hello and welcome. Today I'm joined by Brian Hall, who's Executive Chairman at Great Western Mining. How are you today, Brian? Yeah, I'm fine today. Thank, thanks, uh, Zach. And how are you? I'm doing well. I think we spoke before and I think it went without any negative incidents. So uh, we're back again for more uh, excitement. Um, before we get started with the, the sort of the nitty gritty questions, could you just give us an overview of the company and the current focus? We have a triple focus in the company. Uh, the, the first is to get a, a, a plant, a process mill for processing gold and silver up and running, which we're working on and making good progress with. Uh, our second focus is to narrow down our many options for exploring gold and silver. Uh, exploration can be pretty hit and miss, but we've done pretty well over the last couple of years. Uh, and we have a, quite a few options, but we need to know which one we're going to go for, and that's what we should be working on this year. And um, thirdly, we want to kickstart a copper project, which is uh, above our capacity as a, as a company to take any further forward at this stage, but we're looking for other people to work with, and, and uh, it's very important for us to get that moving forward. So that's really what we're doing. Uh, we've made a lot of progress on these uh, on these three aims in 2022, and we expect to continue in 2023. 2023 is proving to be a busy year already, and we're doing fine. Uh, you've announced your full year results for the year ending 2022. Could you pick up uh, or pick out any key achievements or highlights uh, for investors to look at? Uh, yes, uh, we. I, I think the, probably the two most interesting things that have happened in 2022 were that uh, we we finally signed a joint venture agreement to build a, a mill, uh, the, the one I just uh, mentioned. Uh, and that's that was a, a, a big step forward, which we're going to take advantage of. Uh, the second thing I think that was a, a, an achievement worth noting in 2022 was that we think we we found a, an extension to the vein at the old Omco mine, which we've been exploring for the last two or three years, uh, which is uh, which is extremely interesting and takes things to a new a new stage right and uh, obviously investors are always interested in uh, production and uh, your production mm -hmm. project and the possibility of a company the size of great western producing revenue with the junior resource sector or in that se sector that's quite unique so uh, what's the latest on potential production and the project yeah well it, like everything that uh, that's worth doing it's never as easy as you as you hope but it's getting there very nicely now. Uh, we've, we found a, uh, an excellent joint venture partner who we work with very closely. Uh, he has a mill site, which we are going to use on, on a peppercorn rent basis. Uh, he has a yard full of equipment and we are financing the construction of the mill itself, which is now going ahead. Uh, we had some delays because of a, an extended winter, but that's behind us now and everything is moving forward. And we expect to be uh, producing our first uh, uh, precious metal concentrates uh, during the course of, of this year's. So that is a relatively uh, exciting thing for people to look at. I think it's not an exciting. I think it's transformational for a company like ours. We're a microcap aim exploration company. Uh, very few companies like ours have revenues, and our objective is to have revenues in the company rather than simply spend shareholders' money on exploring and more exploring. So I think it's it's something that which will transform from the company, and this I think is the key year. Um, yeah. you're, you're, I mean, obviously, the production and precious metals exploration is and will be exciting. Um, could it be that uh, furthering the copper resource of uh, your Black Mountain project by bringing, a, bringing in a partner would also take the company up a few notches? Um, yes, it certainly would. Now, uh, an exploration company can swim in shallow water or it can swim in deep water. The objective of an exploration company should be to have a project which is too big for it to handle on its own. In other words, it, it, this is what I mean by swimming in deep water. Uh, we are a little bit out of depth on the copper because uh, it requires the sort of money that is quite beyond our means. So uh, we're looking to take the uh, the copper project forward. Uh, we're looking for a partner to do it with. We're talking to a number of people. We're getting a lot of encouraging uh, sounds, but of course, encouraging sounds are not the same as doing a, 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 as actually closing a deal. So we've still got some way to go. And I, I can't say that we are inside of signing anything up at the moment, uh, but we're very optimistic that we will find uh, a, a partner of one kind or another to help us finance what could be a major project and quite beyond the scale, scale of anything that, uh, that Great Western could develop on its own. 
And finally, is there any message that you would like to offer either existing shareholders or potential investors or people researching the company uh, to sort of uh, chew on or think about? Yes, I, I think the I really revert to my my triple focus. If we can be a revenue producing company this year and the revenues, we haven't given any very specific specific numbers on the uh, on the revenues we'd like to achieve so far uh, because frankly we do, we don't we won't have any until we see how the whole thing works but we would like investors to focus on the fact that we are getting towards the start of production and then we expect it to begin small and build up month by month quarter by quarter year by year so we i think to for for something to chew on is the fact that we we will have a revenue earning business. And the other thing to chew on is that uh, we have potentially uh, a major copper uh, discovery uh, right under our feet. Brian Hall, Executive Chairman at Great Western Mining. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you, Zach. Thank you for listening. Remember to visit our website for more news and other podcasts at www.share-talk.com.